Hello everybody and welcome to another Armored Warfare replay brought to you by your good buddy Don't Fear the Reaper. Today's replay is titled What's More Fun Than a Sack Full of Weasels? And of course the answer is two sack full of weasels. Yes, we have a double replay for you today and in both uh, my battalion mates and I uh, try our luck with two games with nothing but weasels um, in our mix. And these, you know, this is the kind of matchmaking that uh, if you uh, if you ran into it in a random pub match, you'd probably just rage quit. We go out of our way to, to try this kind of stuff just to see if we can get away with it. So let's see if we can get away with it. Fire up the uh, magic replay machine. Now our first game is on the Scorpio map. See, we've got uh, four regular tech tree with weasels and one weasel wolf edition. Now one of the tech tree weasels is also equipped uh, with the gun. The other three are missile armed. And that was by design. Um, what we decided we would try is have the gun-armed weasels act in the traditional role of scouts while the missile-armed weasels ran up on the hill uh, <clears throat> and basically fired at everything uh, that the, uh, the gun weasels could uh, spot for us. You can see, here we are, all in weasels. Gypsy and I have a little facepalm moment there. We move out. Oh, the other thing, um, Major, and he he talked about this with us. He decided it would be uh, interesting to just blow through the E line to uh, activate the bots, um, and then get out of there, not try and fight them. And then the guys on the hill would be able to engage with missiles as they came out. So you can see that they are... He did, in fact, uh, activate all of the bots on the E-line. And he managed to get away with it without getting too shot up. Well, he didn't get shot up at all. Bob's the lead vehicle in our missile arms section. We're banging away at the tanks as we spot them. Some of the E-line tanks are starting to come out to play. Major takes a hit. Bob's trying to work this rock. Not sure what that little earthquake effect is. We saw that twice, once in, the, in this game and once in the other game. Bob takes care of one of the pesky E-line tanks. Rathiel and Major. The, the one bad thing is that the and uh, Major's plan is they cannot move past the key line because there's main battle tanks blocking them. But that doesn't keep them from trying. He's kind of sitting back, farming kills. Well, everybody's doing pretty well. But he is too chewed up. Major's a little worse for the wear, but he's still in there, and I believe he still has a rebuild kit. If and I have a little bump and grind there. 
saw there's a ramp cut moving up on Major and Raphael. Really need to engage that thing. I'm not really sure anybody sees it at this point. It's kinda, I know it's there because of the replay. But I don't remember anybody calling out to try and get the thing. Gypsy spots it. Oh, I thought he spotted it. Obviously, the gun tanks. Oh, yeah, he spotted it. He's throwing some damage in there. We need to get that thing out of there. And he is out of there. Hooray. Major and Ray still working to try to get past the uh, E-line spawn. But they're mostly, uh, uh, right now, they're uh, affecting a crossfire across the river. Bob. Bob is having a bit of an issue. Because every time he pops over this rock, trying to engage the uh, bots uh, that are at the cap circle, there's something able to, able to spot him. So, that is not good news. And he's got a he's got a warrior. Oh, but warrior problem is solved. It's a solid hit on that Rumka. Voids return fire. Rumka is moving up. Okay. So far, we're doing pretty well, just kind of poking ridge lines, using con concealment, uh, trying to prioritize threats and deal with them. Bob is slowly but surely getting into a position. Oh no, he's set on fire by that Ramka. Oh, and there he goes. So we lost Bob. But, even though Bob is lost, the game is not yet lost, so we keep on fighting. Now see, there's that earthquake effect again. I'm not really sure what's going on with that. Bob acquitted himself well. He did 8,000 damage before that uh, Rompka made sushi out of him. Got another Rompka that... We don't get rid of that guy. He's going to take make sushi out of somebody else. One down, one to go. One up over by the cap. Take that Abrams out of there, and I do. Now we've got a stingray that's popped up to uh, attack our light section. Oh, we take him out. Gypsy has the fun and frolic of trying to uh, take out a challenger too that's probably facing him. Just not paying attention, ram him as hard and fast as I can. You didn't need those six hits. Ramka is banging. Well done, Black Company. Got some of that poison off the street. Got to get that Ramka out of there before he takes me out, and we do. Got the bots backed up in the corner like you would in a regular old game. 
Uh, thing is, is that we have to keep our distance. Taking that challenger to drop an issue. Happily, he can't see me. There's no way to spot for him anymore. I'm just waiting for an opportunity to land one on him. Swing and a miss there. Again. Ah! Not a lot of damage, but every little bit helps. Hold that bridge. Major Don't comes around to circle strafe through. the guy. And he's out of there. Got another Ramka. At this point, there's two minutes left. We look at the number of tanks, and we make the determination that we cannot kill all. We can't do a kill all win. So the call goes out to cap out. That's going to be a bit of a challenge because the Vizel does not have a smoke discharger. So all we have is our speed and our camo rating but um, at least race the L has the security con security control packet that we cap very sure quickly and we uh, well we pull out a win now because we lost Baba Nobu it wasn't the most satisfying win and the fact that we had to settle for a cap victory uh, we could not do a uh, kill all victory we just ran out of time. So we decide that we're going to try this again. See if we can't do just a little bit better. To our replay machine and go to our second game, which is on quarterback. Again, we have two gun bunnies, gun armed weasels, and three missile boats. Um, what we decide to do, the tactic we choose to do initially, um, is the um, gun armed weasels are going to run up the western side of the map along that river while the uh, missile weasels uh, are going to take the traditional tank destroyer spot up on the hillside um, around the uh, H456, you know, just running that uh, running that hillside up to the factory. The PLM sprung a surprise attack on us and took over the refinery, but you're going to help us take it back. We need to take the refinery, otherwise the PLM will control oil prices for the entire. A3 region. pops up right off the bat. And without the squeaky wheel gets the grease, and he got three gre three doses of grease as all three of us fired our missiles and just obliterated that main battle tank. <coughs> Major has managed to get uh, way up there to the B line very early on, poking ridge line so he can get spots. And the missile weasels killing everything that they can get their uh, little tow missiles on. Can't remember. A couple of well placed missiles, and that leopard evaporates. Now we got artillery problems. Check on Major here. Notice how he uses the the rear deck of his vehicle when he's poking ridge lines because you get a little better gun depression doing that with a lot of these tanks. So we have to look at the stat line to, to see if this is a, a good tactic for a particular vehicle or not. He 
he uh, appears to be in a pretty good spot. He's uh, slowly farming damage. Everybody's doing well. Check out Baba Nobu poking this ridge line. QA6 there. Oh, and he's looking the wrong way. That must mean it's time to put a missile up his poop shoot, and he does. No good stuff there. Takes a shot at that Makava. Not sure what happened. Mister just bounced. I think uh, Makava has APS. Ah, but he gets him the second go round with a little help from his friends. Major is going around. Oop. Takes a hit. Dancing with that stingray. Sure, I may have. Sure, he was hunting the artillery, and from where he's positioned, he might probably has already gotten it. The gets up on this hillside. Nope, the artillery is there. Time for a little circle strafing, and it's adios artillery. Hooray! Good job, Major. So now we've got to get rid of all the bots sitting in the cap circle. Got the Major over on this hillside. Bob and I are trying to go attack down the middle, but that is not working well. I am trading shots with these guys, and that is not something you want to be doing in a Vizel. Bob decides the same thing. Ray, at a little more discreet distance, is having more luck shooting down that gap. And Gypsy is sitting up here on the other side of the cap circle. Farm and damage. Doing quite well for himself. Well positioned. Uh, spawns don't really have a shot at him. Banging away at that 2A6. Anything else that pops up in the cap circle. Ray's having to give ground as that 2A6 comes down. He uses his repair kit. We're all moving in for the final end game match. Raphael doing a very dangerous dance of death with this 2A6. Whoa, that was close. That was close. Good job. Major comes down, gives him a hand. That leopard is out of here. We've got about four minutes left. Still have everybody. Yep. Ramp is, we definitely want that guy out of there, and he is out of there. Between the... Uh, Gun bunnies and the missile boats. He didn't. Uh, he didn't last very long. But another Terminator pops up to take his place. Everything is looking pretty good right now for us to be able to do uh, a kill-all game rather than having to cap out. Major is on perilously low health. He backs off. Hopefully he has a repair kit. Down to 90 hit points. 
like raphael has got his engine shot out. Chips is coming around the corner with his missile to give these bots some grief in their spawn point. Now we just have that sting right rid of. He runs up to his sniper hole, but they manage to uh, take him out. So we've got about two minutes left. There's probably only one or two bots left. And there's one of them, Stingray. I'll move to uh, see what we can do to take care of him. Well and there you go. Enjoy your payday. A kill all victory in five weasels. We cry for happy. It can be done. So there you have it. Two replays of all Vesel action. I really enjoyed playing again, as as per usual. I really enjoyed playing uh, this game. Watching it half as much as we enjoyed uh, doing it for you. So until next time, happy tanking.